NS 1.1, I can categorize real numbers, and you have this real number sheet in your notes. Um, before we actually talk about uh, rational and irrational numbers, integers, whole numbers, and natural numbers, I want you to understand the way the chart works. So let's say that we have this chart of food, and then this protein, meat, and pork. So the things that are food that go out here would be things like ice cream, uh, Let's see, tomatoes, um, things like uh, chips, and you can think of many more. And then things that would work for protein, but we're not at meat yet, would be things like beans and um, maybe even like... Uh, peanuts or something like that, uh, or, you know, other things that would go there, like even like protein shakes or other things. Cheese, uh, to some extent is a protein, but there's, it's also kind of considered part of the fats. And, uh, so then meat, uh, something that would go here would be like lobster or chicken, but then in pork, Things like uh, bacon and pork roast. Okay, so the way that this works is uh, the things that are outside uh, stay with the things that are the outside. And then, so like for example, beans are a protein and they are a food. Nuts are a protein and they are a food. Ice cream doesn't work in any of these, but it is a food. Tomatoes are a food. Chips are a food. Okay, a lobster is protein and food. A chicken would be protein. Chicken would be meat, protein, and food. Same thing with lobster: meat, protein, and food. Bacon. Bacon would be pork, meat, protein, food. Roast. Pork would be pork, meat, protein, and food. So the things on the inside go with everything. Uh, the things to the outside to the outside only go with those things on the outside. So ice cream is not any of these. But beans are protein and food. Okay, so that's how the, the thing works. So we've got this real numbers chart.